Sophia Lawrence is a 15-year-old girl that was murdered on the night of December 14, 2018. She was found dead in the janitor's closet at 7.45 p.m. However Sophia Lawrence was a great student. She had all straight A's but she got picked on and bullied yet nobody knows why. A lot of her teachers say she always tried her best and had the greatest attitude. So why would people bully her? Why was she murdered? Who could have possibly done this? Ten suspects are interviewed for her murder. These are their stories. <laughs>
Why did they move? It's moved. The other one is homeschooled, and the three other never came to school because they were bullied. I'm sorry to hear that, but can you tell me more about your relationship with Sophia and the other girls too? Well, first she makes fun of my mom, and she barely makes any money because she works at a restaurant. Then she has the audacity to make fun of my TikTok videos, but they're so good. And then she draws big mustaches on me. I'm sorry to hear that, but what is TikTok? <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot you were 80. Well, TikTok is like where you make videos of yourself lip singing. Okay, is there anything else you could tell me about Sophia? Basically just means to everyone, and she had to find something she didn't like about you. Mm, I see. Oh my god, look how cute George is. I don't know how to tell you this, but this is Sophia's boyfriend. Excuse me, Sophia's dating my boyfriend? Hey, 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 calm down. Uh, shut up, Detective Araya. It's Amaya. Whatever, it's taking the love of my life. Do you by any chance know who are Sofia's closest friends? Uh, Jackie Reyes, Dulce Rivera, and Navea Gonzalez. This is Dulce's number. I'm very sorry that you experienced that. Thank you for... Sorry, I need to take this. Hello? Hey, Rach. I just came back from the morgue, and they found some pieces of evidence. What are they? Okay, so he found dead skin cells under her fingernails. Okay. And he found bloody fingerprints on the side of her neck. Is that all he found? Oh wait, and he found some strands of hairs that weren't Sophia's. Okay, sounds good. No, the only problem is how are you going to get people's DNA to see if it matches? I'd probably have to get DNA from each suspect I've talked to, don't you think? I mean, yeah, but I don't think any of them were part of it. After you told me how they responded to you, they seem like they're telling the truth. Maybe ask the girls who Sophia hung out with. Sounds like a plan. I'll call you back later. Bye. All right, bye. Hi, please come in. Hi. Can you take a seat? Take to Rachel Mara, nice to meet you. Dulce Rivera. I work with CPD and I'm here just to ask you a couple questions about Sophia Lawrence. Sophia Lawrence? What about her? She was like a sister to me. Well, Sophia was murdered last Friday at your school. Wait, you don't think I killed her, right? I I would never kill somebody. I wouldn't even hurt a fly. I I capture spiders and release them outside. Relax, Dulce. I just want to ask you a couple questions, okay? We found strands of your hair at the crime scene. Could you tell me why they might have ended up there? What do you mean, my strands of hair? Well, our forensic team found too many hairs on Sophia's sweater. I, I, I don't know how I got there. So tell me, Dulce, did you murder Sophia? No, that might be my hair, but I didn't kill her. She was like a sister to me. Why did you kill Sophia? Oh my god, I didn't! Why would I kill her? She's one of my best friends. Wait, did you say there was hair in her sweater? That is correct. We are both in drama club, and it was freezing in the auditorium. So I asked about her sweater. I gave it back to her and left right after because I had to pick up my little sister from daycare. That is why you found my hair in her sweater. Okay, how close were you and Sophia? Was there anything you didn't like about Sophia? Oh my god! She was like a sister to me, and we have been friends forever. She was a little rude with me sometimes, but that was it. Maybe she was rude to some people. Who was the closest to Sophia? Jackie Reyes or Navea Gonzalez? She was close to both of them, equally. We were all friends, but lately she has been having some problems with Navea because Sophia dated Navea's ex, which was George. George who? Curious George. <laughs> Are you serious? I need you to answer my questions truthfully. George Valens, my god, you can't handle a joke. This is the investigation of Sophia Lawrence. She was murdered. Okay, you're free to go. Your sister has also been waiting for you outside. But first, I need Jackie's phone number. No, I don't have her phone number. I have to go. Give me the phone. No! Why not? 
My mom told me not to give my phone to strangers. Give me the phone, don't say. Can't give it to strangers. I mean, she's right. But this is an investigation of a murder. So I need you to hand me your phone. Okay. Hello? Hey Lauren, I finished interviewing Dulce and there's something wrong with her. She's very suspicious. What was suspicious about her? I asked her for her phone repeatedly to get Jackie's number, but she hesitated to hand me over the phone. She was extremely nervous, not really wanting to tell me everything she knows about the case. So are you saying you think she's the killer? I don't think she is, but there's something going on with her. Just try looking through her phone, okay? Sounds good. Bye. Bye. Hi, how can I help you? Detective Lauren Flores, nice to meet you. Now we work with CBD and we're just here to ask your daughter a couple questions if that's alright with you. Why do you need to talk to her? It's about an investigation of a murder. We need some information from her. Okay, come on in. I'm gonna have to take a look around. Okay, go ahead. to admit that you killed your own best friend? Afraid that you're gonna be the talk of the school? Afraid that your parents will never live in existing? Or that you're gonna be in jail for the rest of your life? Please, leave me alone. I, I didn't do anything to her. Come on, Jackie, admit that you killed your best friend. I didn't kill her, okay? I saw her body in the locker room and I grabbed it and put it in the janitor's closet. I need more details, Jackie. Look, I didn't kill Sophia, okay? But believe me when I tell you this. Go on. After swimming practice, I stayed after to talk to my coach about my skills. Before I walked out the door, I saw blood on the floor. It turned out to be Sophia's blood. So I dragged her body and put it in the closet. Too afraid to call the cops because I thought they would think it was me. Anything else? No, that's all. I'm sorry, I should have called the cops. Please forgive me. Thank you for your honesty, Jackie. Ready to go, Maya? Yeah, let's go. Bye! Jackie didn't kill her, Lauren. That girl totally told the truth. Well, she probably is. I searched around and I found nothing. But the way she acted, it was like she was so timid. She mumbled her words at first, very scared and shaky. As soon as I talked about Sophia, Jackie raged. She came at me with anger. But she did tell me the truth. I think she was just nervous. We have to go check the locker room. Maybe we can find something else. Okay, let's go check in the locker room. All right, let's go. Forest. 
This is my partner, Detective Rachel Amaya. We work for CPD. We were wondering if you could look around for an investigation of a murder. Yeah, go ahead. My name is Mrs. Bennett, by the way. Hey, Lori, come and check this out. What is it? Got a blood in the note, apparently. What does it say? Come meet me at the locker, girl. Okay, girl. Hey, Miss Bennett, do you know who could have possibly been here on Friday? I mean, Fridays are usually practice for girls cheerleading. Um, you know what? Let me get the list for you of the girls on the team. Of course, it's her. You ready to time this minute? Of course. Wait, you guys know who killed her? I don't know why. I have a feeling that they have killed her. Yeah, it all makes sense. Nevea was mad because she took her ex. She wrote the paper. She was on the cheerleading team. Sounds like she was a little jealous. Well, I think you're right. Let's go to her house and ask her some questions. Maybe we can find out if she was the one who killed Sophia. Okay, let's go. Hey, I'm Detective Rachel Maya. I work with CPD, and this is my partner, Detective Flores, and we're here. I don't know who y'all are, so I suggest you leave. It's about your friend, Sophia Lawrence. She was murdered. She was what? She was murdered. Oh my god, that was my best friend. I know this can be hard for you, Nevea, but I really need you to answer our questions, okay? That girl was everything to me. I loved her. I'm gonna have to take a look around if that's okay with you, Nevea. I mean, I ain't okay with that. Like, I have some pretty personal stuff, you know? Yeah, I don't care. Ugh, whatever, detective. What do you need to ask me anyway? First, I need to know what your relationship was with Sophia. Are you kidding me? My girl Sophia, she was amazing. We can always relate to each other. What do you mean by relate? We both have messed up lives, but when we hang out, we always help each other. Sounds like you two are pretty close. Now answer me this question. Why is there dead skin cells underneath Sophia's fingernails? The DNA match said it was yours. Well, how am I supposed to know? Well, you tell me. Tell you what? That you killed your best friend? Mm, no, I didn't. Why are you lying, Nevea? Who said I was lying? Well, if you can't explain to me why your DNA was on her, then explain this note to me. I remember this. Um, I told her to come by the locker so we could cheerlead, duh. Cheerleading? Are you serious? <laughs> oh yeah, you don't know what that is. You're too old. <laughs> Be quiet and start answering my questions. So stop lying. I'm not lying. I know you hated Sophia because she dated George. You're jealous, aren't you? Mad because your best friend dated the guy you liked? I'm not. I was just mad. Go on. This girl took my base. She knew I loved him and not only that, she was dating Anthony at the same time, and we were best friends. Oh, so that's why you killed her. I didn't kill her. I was just mad at her. Are you stupid or something? Come down, Nevea. It's just a bit strange to me of how you put a no in her locker. Again, for cheerleading, you really think I'm going to kill my best friend for that? You got some issues, lady. So if you were mad at her for taking your ex, why did you oh. give her a no that said you wanted to cheerlead? You obviously still liked her, or... Is that when you plan to kill her? I don't know. I guess I just wanted to apologize. Oh, guys. Oh, okay. I believe you. Come on, Nevaeh. Just say it. Why are you afraid, huh? Thought so you were just trying to chase. You are like pretty weak. Shut up. I didn't kill her. I didn't kill her. I swear I didn't kill her. Detective! Look what we 
have here. Die disgusting rat, kill yourself. Are you kidding me? You had these pictures of her crossed out? I don't know. Those aren't mine, I swear. Vera Gonzalez, you are under arrest for the murder of Sophia Lawrence. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney if you cannot afford one. One will be appointed for you. I don't know why you're arresting me. I didn't even do anything. Really? Explain those pictures then. I told you they're not mine. They are. Yes, hurry up. What's going on, Lauren? We weren't supposed to arrest Nevaeh. Look at this. Oh my god. The, the, the... Secrets I can't tell I love the smell of gasoline I like the match to taste the heat I've always liked to play with fire oh. 